had an almost cry, wanted to quit, but we kept going. Oh my god. Oh yeah, of course. Happy September, everyone. My favorite time of year has officially started. The start of autumn, the start of the cozy times of the year, and with a new season means redecorating and reorganizing my bookshelf because there are a few things on my bookshelf that I'm just not very happy with and I'm going to be redecorating it in this video. The majority of my bookshelf still looks okay, it is just a few shelves. So let's take a look at what my bookshelf looks like now and what I plan on changing. Okay, so here is the main bit that I want to change because Right here, I've got just general fiction, literary fiction, then I've got my classics, then my non-fiction, but down here, that is more literary fiction, historical fiction, and I kind of want to have these books with these books. So what I'm going to be doing is moving these shelves down, but I also need to remove the shelves and like put them in a different height because um, otherwise it wouldn't fit. So I'm going to take all of these books off change the shelves and then move my general fiction and historical fiction up here. So this is all together, if that makes sense. My top shelves and my bottom shelves are actually fine as is, but maybe I will add a few autumnal decorations because I've got a few cute bits and bobs that I maybe want to put on my shelf. For example, some of these cute pumpkins or toadstools. So I'm going to see if I can put them somewhere to make my bookshelf look extra cozy. By the way, by the time I'm filming this, it's like the end of August, it is still very much summer. I am hot. I keep using this thing because everything is sweaty. My cheeks are very rosy, don't mind that. Oh, I've got a sweaty upper lip and I'm going to be filming an autumnal book redecorating. Let's just get started. I'm way too excited about this. I hope you're going to enjoy this video. I hope you're going to enjoy the rest of my autumnal and cozy videos because this truly is the start of the next few cozy months. So let's get started. I'm going to take this off because it is way too hot for that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to remove all the books and then change the shelves. Okay, these books are all off. Now I just need to measure how high the shelf must be so this shelf can go completely over there. So I'm just gonna grab the tallest book from this shelf to see how, you know, high it should be. Definitely this one, because this doesn't fit right now. So let's see, maybe I should also clean the shelves first. I think if I just put this one lower, it should fit. Yes, perfect. Okay, now I'm just going to put all these books on here. Oh my God, oh my God. No! Why does always something fall when I'm redoing my bookshelf? Oh no! I thought there was still a bookend in that book so it could stay, but I took it out. And now my hourglass broke. Okay, there's like glass everywhere. I should put on some shoes. Oh yeah, of course. I think I'm cursed with redoing my bookshelves, for real. <sighs> I'm gonna clean this up. Okay, I nearly cried because it was a gift from one of my best friends and I'm so freaking sad, but I'm going to get a new one because I just love an hourglass so much, especially like a larger one that you can do reading sprints with and I am not going to be putting it down there where a book can fall on it. 
I'm shaking a little bit. Why? But we do need to continue with organizing this because now my books are everywhere and now I don't really feel like doing it, but I need to. So um, I am cursed. Can someone lift this bookshelf reorganization curse off me, please? Okay, let's continue putting these books up there and using bookends to make sure that they don't fall again. All the books are where they are supposed to be on their designated shelf. Now I just need to move them around a bit to make it look nice and to make sure that everything fits because it doesn't look good right now. And then I also need to put back my plants and maybe put some autumn decorations here and there. So let's do some reorganizing of the books. <laughs> oh, where to begin? Bookends. Very important. Okay, I think all the books are where I want them to be, so now it is just time to, you know, put back my plants and put some little trinkets here and there to make it look cozy and autumnal. I quit. I bloody quit. I swear the amount of WhatsApp stickers I have for this situation is insane. I can't believe that just happened. I just vacuumed all this dirt from my floor and we're just going to keep smiling through the pain and continue redecorating. This video is a dumpster fire, <laughs> but I want to finish. So um, for now, I just have this plant here. This one looks safe. I'm going to try to put the other one there, but this one... <sighs> Don't fall. Oh, all my books are pushed back because I had to vacuum literally every single shelf because there was dirt on every single shelf. <laughs> oh my goodness, insane. Um, let's put these back. Help me. Help me. I am shaking. This was not the day to do this. But I'm not gonna give up, so... Okay, okay. A little fake candle going here, I think. Want to put this cute pumpkin somewhere. Don't drop it. Okay, maybe here. This looks nicer. I'm going to put the plant back, but I am afraid to film it because I'm scared it will fall again. First I'm gonna water it to make sure it gets a bit heavier and then I need to fix like it's too heavy the leaves are too heavy um, so I have to do something about it but I'll be back. Okay friends I think we're done I'm just going to try to not touch anything anymore especially not this plant. Um, it does look a bit not centered I don't know what's happening with these vines but oh Oh well. This is what the finished result looks like. I've got these cute little pumpkins here and here and now these two shells are all of my fiction, historical fiction, adult fiction. Then we've got classics and then we've got non-fiction and I think it looks much better like this and everything has its own place. This is Brit from the future. I want to give you a little update on this plant. What I did is I've changed the pots. This pot used to be on this plant. As you can see, this pot kind of rounds a bit, so it's much less 
stable on the bottom. However, this plant is not so heavy. And this plant apparently is very heavy, but this pot is not rounded, so it is much more stable. So fingers crossed that this is never happening again. I am now just going to take a very deep breath and not touch my plants and hope that it will stay this way. This video was not how I planned it. Had an almost cry, wanted to quit, but we kept going. And now my bookshelf looks nice and organized and tidy for autumn. I still hope that you liked this video. Please do give it a thumbs up. And if you want to comment something, but you don't know what to comment, make the comment section look very autumnal because that will always brighten my day. I'm now going to sit in front of a fan and hopefully cool down a bit because I've got another sweaty upper lip and I'm gonna cool down. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you are having a very fantastic day and I will hopefully see you in my next video that will, fingers crossed, hopefully not turn out to be a video in which everything goes wrong.